So the way I met Charlie, we both worked together at a factory called Ferris Slacks. He was our marketing uh, vice president of marketing and really promoted our company extremely well. But his passion was for people. There was 10,000 employees and he connected with the factory people in trying to elevate them at every level that he could. And he actually went on to greener pastures. He moved to California and uh, he went to work for some large corporations, Disney, uh, Warner Brothers. During that time period, there was some investigations going on that the global industry was being unfair to the workers. So they knew Charlie's background and they hired him and empowered him to go into those markets all over the, all over the world to correct those issues. One of the big, big areas, there's a, a book, Magic in the Desert, that was started by an author who, who was actually a sports writer during the time that the New Mexico State Aggies went undefeated. But unfortunately, while he was writing the book, he passed away. Susan was the love of his life. And uh, when they found out that she had Alzheimer's, it was devastating. It was very, very difficult for Charlie. And when she did pass on, he uh, created a scholarship and endowment for the School of Nursing in Susan's name and her honor that to this day exists. And he, uh, he honored her so well, but not just her. He took it back to honoring <laughs> the university through her because she loved the university as much. That's the type of guy he is. And I've known him for half century, hard to believe. Everything that he does is interwoven with being an Aggie. And the last thing he always says to me is, go Aggies.